is up YouTube it's Jay Hernandez with another video for you guys um, it is the day after Christmas so I hope everybody had a great Christmas and I hope everybody spent it with <laughs> I hope everybody spent it with their family and loved ones um, today's video I'm just gonna be reviewing the Yeez reels another pair of Yeezys in the collection I don't know if I'm gonna keep these or not but I do know that I got them for a very good price I actually got them for like $30 under retail I got them for like $190 because I had some credit on on Hebbets, Hebbet Sports. So I'm gonna be looking at those with you guys and I'm gonna be looking at the Frozen, uh, the very first kind of, I mean the colorway is almost the same but we're just gonna kind of see how they compare or if they compare at all. Um, I actually spent money on the Frozen, on the Frozen Yellows uh, before they re-released, before they restocked. I actually paid like $700 for this pair here that I'm gonna show you guys so the first pair that I'm gonna be showing you guys is this one right here right because this is where it all I feel like the inspiration behind the Yeez reels is definitely the Frozen's and um, I don't have too many of these color like I don't have too many sneakers in, in this colorway I honestly just have these I used to have the Air Force off-white um, but I just wasn't digging them too much so I just got rid of my Air Force my off-whites I think I, I had the black pair and I had the 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 vault pair and yeah I ended up getting rid of them but I feel like these are gonna look a lot like these that are inside the box but let's take a look at the size tag there you guys see it. it's a uh, size nine and a half I always go up a half size when it comes to Yeezys so if you guys are thinking about getting a pair of Yeezys for you or for somebody else make sure you go a uh, half size up on their original size trust me um, colorway is Yeezreal Yeezreal if that is how you pronounce the name um, and like I mentioned like I got these from Hibbit Sports and l let me stop by saying uh, I want to say thank you to everybody that's been subscribing to the channel um, I almost I almost forgot to say that I, I always like to thank everybody that's been subscribing so thank you so much for subscribing to the channel it means a lot we're on the road to 500 and then we're gonna be on the road to a thousand but 500 is definitely gonna be uh, a marker in my YouTube career and a uh, thousand is gonna be like I, I'm gonna feel like I think a thousand is gonna feel like a huge accomplishment because I don't have any social media whatsoever so I don't have any help from that and honestly I, I could count on my fingers how many people that I actually know that are subscribed to my channel and I'd still have a few fingers left you know I, I think I only got like maybe a good six or seven people that I actually personally know that have subscribed to my channel but um anyway like I said I got these at Hibbits they even sent me a a little card saying thank you for purchasing these bricks so you know they that's how you know like they're desperate to get these Yeezys out of there because they even sent me a thank you letter for getting them off their shelf but Anyway, I've had these here for a little while and I haven't even like looked at them. I've had way too many like better pickups than these and I felt like the reviews on those were it was better than doing a review on these just because I feel like everybody got these. But uh, there you guys have them and it is a Yeezy uh, V2 Yeez uh, Reel. It's got your tags on the side. And yeah, so let's get the other pair out. So here you guys have them right here. These things are bright. They're really, really bright. They match the shirt that I got from, uh, from what's his name? Uh, I already forgot his name. I guess Tom. I, I always want to say Ray Ray, but he changed his name. He changed his uh, YouTube channel to uh, Tom. Another thing is there was a YouTuber that did make a, a video talking about like the T-shirts and stuff like that. I just want to say like I didn't expect any sneakers from like in it like obviously like I have such bad luck even if he was sending those sneakers out I don't know whether he he actually gives the sneakers away or he doesn't give them away I don't know man I I really don't know if if there is somebody that has gotten the sneakers from nobody's heard about it but I also don't want to say anything against him but I'm cool with Ron uh, using my video to uh, show awareness to some people that it might be a scam but at the same time I mean, I'm not trying to, uh, I mean, the, the thing that I was disappointed about was the t-shirts, you know, just being the same design and just um, two of the same colors. That's what I was more upset about. 
the sneakers it would have been dope because it would have been something cool for me for the channel for me to unbox the sneaker from his channel i thought that would have been so dope if i would have won but at the same time I'm, i just having something small to unbox that wasn't 200 dollars or something like that you know just having a little something extra to unbox and i'm gonna be doing that a lot like i'll buy i'm gonna I'm, my my next plan is to buy some uh merch off of tony d's channel i want to buy some of them sample slides i think they look really clean um so i might be unboxing that soon you know some slides or something i don't know but uh like i said it, it wasn't really a shot towards uh ray ray it was just uh come on bro like you got a huge audience people are buying these t-shirts don't get lazy bro because it could it could come back and bite you in the ass you know what i mean like just giving me the same t-shirts and like hearing so many other people getting the same t-shirts you know it was just kind of like damn bro come on you know like it's just a little you know a little slap on the wrist from the youtube police you know what i'm saying but anyway uh shout out to ron for making that video that was a dope video i thought it was funny um me and my girl were watching it. we thought it was funny and his editing skills are like way out of this world bro like if you guys don't uh watch ron's channel go ahead and uh watch it man this dude's i mean his, his reviews are pretty dope man but uh anyway back to the subject these verse these pretty much the same sneaker man i'm not gonna lie this is pretty much the same shoe um this is just more of a yellowish green and this is just like that glow that that glow green you know what i'm saying like but i mean just th this is definitely a sneaker that really really pops this one i think i'd have to go with these just because they're more subtle to me and just i like gum bottom so to me the gum bottom is really nice and just the patterns on it is is way nicer you like that the v2 the original uh the original um pattern that it has with like the zebra looking uh color or whatever just I, I feel like these take the cake if they had to go up against each other but uh honestly i don't know it's crazy to think that these were one of the most limited yeezys on the market like i, I like i think that for a while this was the most limited shoe before they restocked this I, there was only so many of these and these things were going for so much money like i said i'm never going to get rid of these just because i know how much i paid for them i used some goat credit and i i, I cashed down the goat credit little did i know six months later they'd be sitting on shelves everywhere but these i picked them up for 190 dollars and to me that's crazy you know to pick up yeezys for under retail uh, so i had to pull the trigger on them but they're fire um if you guys see the pull tabs they're definitely exactly the same yep the same orange there you guys see it they got the same pull tab like the lines you guys see the line is that same orange um they're very close like very very close other than the gum bottom and just like the the yellow and of course you got your see-through uh your see-through material right here on the newer v2s and this one don't got it personally i like this better than people seeing your dirty ass sock in there but um your insole is a white insole this one stayed true and, and that one stayed that frozen yellow but overall i feel like this is way better than this um i might just keep this just because i got it under retail um and it's just i don't know it's it's pretty crazy it's a dope it's a, it's it's a dope sneaker um i feel like i'd probably wear it in the summer um but like i said this one i haven't really worn it much either and i will wait till everybody beats their pairs up and then i'll bring mine out but let me know which one you guys like better which one do you think is better do you think the frozen yellows are better or do you think the yeez reels are better y'all let me know in the comment section uh just a little video to stay you know just to stay uh consistent and, or, and and just to review a shoe that i picked up um i have a lot of sneakers that i have not reviewed yet and i really want to yikes tomorrow man it's all catching up to me because i got the air force one i'm a i'm an air i don't know how to pronounce that what bro what are you talking about man but i have those and then i have the ones that i'm gonna unbox tomorrow i'm gonna unbox two of them tomorrow so 
yeah it's it's crazy so make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel um, we are like at 270 close to 270 people right now subscribers so thank you to every single one of you guys that have been watching the channel and thank you for everybody that's been uh, staying loyal to the channel I appreciate every single one of you guys I hope you guys have um, a good rest of your week and we'll catch you guys back on my channel um, Saturday I'll probably be back no 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 I'm lying I'll be back tomorrow for make sure you guys stay tuned for Friday night unboxing episode 2 and I'm out of here have a good night guys